All right, everybody, I'm Johnny Scoville. I'm David Martin. And this is Chase the Heat. This is the one you guys have been waiting for, huh? Yeah. We've got the Tube of Terror. So this is, you know, we've, since the very beginning, people have been saying, you gotta do the tube, you gotta do the tube. Right. Two nights ago, my man messaged me, said he was ready for one, at least maybe two. Maybe two. And now we're gonna do it. You ready? Yeah. We yeah. prepped. You gotta make sure you have something in your stomach for this. If you guys get a tube, you can get them at, uh, my website, but if you do, make, if you're gonna just sample it, you still probably have food in your stomach, but if you're ever gonna attempt the whole thing, have some food in your stomach, right? So here's what we're gonna do. Um, are you nervous? Yeah, yeah, a little, just a little bit, just a little bit. Good, it's a good thing. You know, to me, uh, this is how I've always seen my channel, the mark of a really good challenge to me yeah. is one that I, I, I'm scared to do, right. and one that I know I won't do again, even before I do it the first time. Yeah. You know what I mean? This isn't a bad one. I mean, I've done, I've done, I've eaten a lot of these too. Right, exactly. But yeah. like, um, some of them I, like, I would reproduce. <laughs> That's only people have asked about lately. I should go back and reproduce all the ones I failed. Because I only failed like four of them. Oh, really? But the ones I failed, like, yes. wouldn't want to redo again. Yeah, I tried to drink a case of hot sauce. And how stupid is that? That's insane. Dumb. Right. No yeah, business. Like, right? Well, if you, were, you were there, you would have said, like, you know, just, you know, right. logistically, with the amount of vo sheer volume of fluid, it's a dumb idea. Right. Where, where were you? You weren't there to stop me. Right. <laughs> anyway, we're going to have fun today. This is going to be a fun one. And let me tell you what we should anticipate. A lot of ear tugging. <laughs> a lot of the Grinch is still Christmas taste. A little Elmer Fudd. A little oh, Mike sure. Tyson. Oh, yeah. should be good. Um, here's what we're going to do. Normally, folks sit down. I kind of like the standing around thing. We talked about sitting down, but you know what David said? Tell me what you said. I, was, I told him I was like five minutes, I'll probably start getting up and start jumping around and definitely pacing myself. So, so since we're going to be up and about anyway, we figured we'd uh, stay standing. So here's what we're going to try to do. We know how people on the internet can be. Not you guys, because you guys are a family. But if we were to do these and, and, like, and like while I was pouring my hand, it dipped down to there for one second. Some of you think that there's somebody here handing me a fake one in that one split second, like we have it tricked or something. So we're going to make sure that we never leave the frame of the camera. We're going to try to do this until the very end. We're going to follow the rules because this is David's first attempt. If he completes this today, he is ranked in the in the League of Fire, which is pretty excellent, right? It really is. Excited. So I mean, anything you can do, you can have a ranking in the world. It's a pretty exciting oh, pick. Sure. So yeah, that's excited. So what the rules are: you have it's a 15-minute challenge. Essentially, you can eat up to two peanuts at a time. Uh, and you have 10 minutes to consume the peanuts at the conclusion of the 10 minutes. Not when you're done eating the peanuts, but at the conclusion of the 10, of the 10 minutes. A uh, five minute afterburn uh, begins. You cannot consume any liquid for the entire 15 minutes. Good. Yeah. All right, so get you guys time already? Yep. Show the people. Oh, yeah, you can't actually see it, but it well, says 10 minutes. 10 minutes, yeah. So you can let's hold these both up here so you can see that these are both you see the wrapper on the top of both of these tubes? These are both brand new. Actually, his is signed. It's right. kind of cool. <laughs> Mine isn't signed. I feel cheated. All right, so um, here we go. We've got to remember the whole time. we got to keep these things. Oh, let me read the ingredients first before we do that. The ingredients are jumbo extra large Virginia peanuts, pure cane sugar, Carolina Reaper peppers, uh, ghost peppers, chocolate pula, seven pot brain strain, seven pot dougla, maruga scorpion, sea salt, and 13 million scoville <laughs> pure capsaicin crystals. And back there, the man who makes these things. Big Al, come here before we start this thing. My man, how you doing, dude? Good luck, fellas. Good luck. Yeah, why? Well, you know oh, what? Your time's coming soon. I ain't there yet, but I'm on the way. <laughs> well, you know you're going to, because we gotta get you in League of Fire. Yeah. I'm gonna get in that League of Fire. Right, it's right, the right. last thing I hey, do. Hey, so you made these. Are these a good one? They the good one. The hot patch? I don't see how y'all do it. <laughs> I believe it when I see it. <laughs> He's next. Oh, Thanks, yeah. Al. All right, guys, so here's what we're going to do. <coughs> Excuse me. Starting now, be real, real good at making sure we keep it in the camera because, honest to goodness, the one time you don't, keep it in this hand, too, because if it's in your other hand, it's right. likely to go that way. I'll try to keep it in this hand, too, because the minute you do that, I swear to you, that's the first thing you're going to say. Right. All right? So we're going to hold this thing up. I, you know? Yeah, I guess there's no other way to do it. It is what it is. All right, so here we go. Brand new tube still. All right. So... Now, by the way, people always ask, are there 25 tubes, are there 30 tubes, how, or uh, peanuts, 25 peanuts, how many are? It's not a number of peanuts, it's by weight. There's one and a half ounces of peanuts. 
in this too. All right, so I'm gonna hold these up. Turn the camera on. So I'm gonna keep these in the frame of the camera. Ready? All right, All right guys. So listen, this is the. Uh, it's David and Goliath with the Tube of Terror. I'm Johnny Scoville. I'm David Martin. Let's chase the heat. All right. There we go. Going. Keep that in the frame, and we're gonna start the process <coughs> two at a time. Cyrus in the house watching over there. Boom. Yeah. They're hot right good. away. They're still good though. They taste great. Now I asked him yesterday how many, or was it this morning? My days meld into each other. I said, how many peanuts have you had of two potatoes? I think you said what, five of them? Five, five, yeah, I think most of them has five in it. It's like 30 in here. Hey Dave. Hey, do we have meat in that here? They're hot right away though. Yeah. Great flavor on these peanuts, they really are. So you probably already had, right about now, it's probably more than you ever had. Probably, yeah. We look for the spot where his tongue uh, becomes paralyzed. Or swells up, one of the other. Feels like it does. <laughs> I can tell that it feels like it does. Wow, hot already. Okay. Yeah. It's a wicked tolerance builder, you guys. If you want to build your tolerance, and use this. <laughs> I got a couple of good ones to have him repeat when he gets going. That's a little in my chest, like right here. Your eyes are starting to go. Burn it off. Now we're looking for the telltale head wobble. Haven't seen it yet. <laughs> so where's your heat on a scale of one to ten? Um okay, right now. Three? Three, yeah. Oh ooh, actually no. Five. Oh, oh no more. Okay. Elmer has entered the building. Wow. About to go Elmer Fudd on us. <laughs> oh, now my tears are kind of hurting. His tears are hurting. Well. I packed these things. They don't look like a lot, but man. Let me ask you a question. You were thinking about doing two tubes. How does that sound now? Pretty warm, huh? And here's the funny thing, we're just getting started. Yeah, look at that. It's not as fun as it looks, is it? <laughs> you got the little cap shiver there, the capsation quiver. Probably at like a uh, two. Six and, a half, six and a half minutes left. You got it. Two and a half, six and a half minutes left before we could even start a five minute afterburn. Boom, it is Mr. David Foy. Woo, woo. Ah. Uh. What's the matter, David? <laughs> How much wood can a wood chop? Chop. Right? <laughs> you got it, you got it. Man. Uh. Okay, so my peanuts are done. I'm just gonna enjoy the ride now. Okay. Listen, you're doing great. You're doing a great job. I'm proud of you. Alright, so the, they taste great even to the end with me. My tolerance is pretty high right now. Relatively high. Okay. So now David's experiencing some drama. Is it, uh, are you, you're not panicking, right? Are you yeah, burning? it's hot. Yeah, it's hot. Is it hot? It's hot, yeah. Okay. Okay, now try be very, very quiet. We're hunting rabbit. Okay. <laughs> try kill the wabbit, kill the wabbit. Okay. His bottom lip is quivering. 
You got this, man. <laughs> Mr. Foy has brought over the boot bucket. The boot bucket, just in case. If you do it, do it off camera. Oh, that's all right. A little bit of snot never killed anybody. It happens. He's oh. running at people. All right, so uh, the heat is actually probably to a three for me right now. My throat's burning pretty good. Shaking. Your hands are shaking. Okay, I'll hold these so you don't have to worry about it. We'll keep this in the frame of camera. You got what? Uh, maybe 10 peanuts left. It's a rough challenge, no joke. Here's the deal, we didn't want it to be a challenge where the hardest part of the challenge was buying it. You know what I mean? I would say that probably six out of 10 people who try this fail. Maybe higher, maybe seven. What's hurting more, the stomach or your mouth? It's just hot, it's hot, I don't know. It's, it's just hot all over? Does it taste like burning? It tastes like burning. Why? Uh, where's your healer lot? I don't know, it's a new level. It's a new level! <laughs> I don't know, and you're sad like a princess. I'm sorry, but you are. He said it's a new level. It really is. Oh. You want any more? No, yeah, I'm finishing it. I'm definitely finishing it. Uh -uh. Oh, man, he's a beast, you guys. He's earning this. We've got, he's got three minutes and 45 seconds to con uh, consume the remaining peanuts in this tube. And from there, he's got a five minute afterburn. <sighs> Boy, you got the sweat going on. Your eyes are glassy. Listen, it's okay. It's an ugly sport. It's gonna happen. You know, when you make it on, you're gonna break some eggs. Ooh, you shake it. You all right? Oh yeah. Maybe you should. Maybe you should stop. Dude, I'm worried about you. Seriously, no, man. I'm worried about you. Look, your your lip is shaking, man. I give a rip. I care. Listen, there's no shame. You've done a lot. Oh, I'm finished. Look at me. Well, I know, but you're shaking this stuff and making me nervous. Keep pushing, Dave. Look at Big Al. Keep pushing. I'm trying to tell him to stop because I don't want to. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to talk him off the ledge and Al's telling him to jump. Keep pushing. I'm tired. We're all behind you, dude. You can do it. Get the shot, All right, we only have it. After that, this is probably his last little palm full of peanuts here. I told you it was going to be a wild one. So here's what we got left, just maybe four peanuts left. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. You alright, man? Yeah. You want some milk? No. Uh -uh. You sure? No, uh -uh. I got uh -uh. Savage right there. Uh -oh. And that's it, people. He is finished. Uh. Whew. This is. Well, you got to eat five minutes for this. Uh -huh, that's right. All right, now we got, we're looking at his time. We got a minute and 53 seconds before we can begin the five minute afterburn. So, um, believe it or not, you probably aren't too far away from it peaking. It's not gonna get a whole lot worse, I would imagine. <laughs> that was your, your heat level. It's a new level, he said. That was uh, awesome. Oh, excuse me, guys. It's all right, relax, dude. It's okay, how do you feel? You got the shake going on. Are you, are you blisteringly high? Yeah. Right. That is no joke. Wow. Hottest thing you've ever eaten? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, it's hot. Yeah. Okay, but there the endorphin has just started. He just started to go. You can see the first second of, wait a minute, I might be having a good time here. Yeah. Until one second ago, there was no happiness, and you just got happy. Yeah, I feel like my cheeks right now, guys. <sighs> but here's the thing. It's all about tolerances. Yeah. The first time I did one tube, it was devastating. It was, really, it was probably like a seven on my scale. I don't remember what heat rating I gave it. The second time I attempted, I did three tubes. And then I ate one peanut out of the fourth tube, because somebody else had done three, I wanted to beat them. <laughs> and then, you know, when we started making these, we never thought people would be eating more than one. Then I was in a contest about six months ago where I ate 10 of them in one contest, and me and uh, three others ate 10 of these things. So um, it's all about where your tolerance is at that moment. Like right now, how's your heat level? 
Uh, I think like a good five, but it's like a like a. Well, how high did? What was the highest it got? Like I said, probably like an eight or nine. It was it was there. <laughs> eight or nine, I love it. Um, but guys, no joke. If, oh. Now what we got is a five minute afterburn, and my big man is in the league of fire. Ranked in the world standings. Isn't that cool, man? I'm jealous. Five minutes. Next, is. I'm, next. I'm jealous, Al says. You're next, dude. I'm next. Al's got it's a foreboding task for Al because he makes these things. So he knows what he's getting himself into. <laughs> Alright, so uh is the heat kind of hovering out of five for you? Is yeah. it? <laughs> yeah. Say uh you wastly wad it. You rascally read it. Now he went R on us instead of the W, but when he tries to do it right, it sounds like he goes just the W. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so mine's down to about a one right now. My heat's kind of climbing back down, but it was fine. Um, good little burn. Good little burn. Yep. I didn't get an uh, endorphin rush. My ears aren't burning. Yeah. That's it. When you get to a certain stage with your tolerance, you'll find that what used to give you an endorphin rush, um, it takes more to get there. So like uh, there was a day where just one tube would give you an amazing endorphin rush and that endorphin rush offsets a lot of the pain that you have during the experience and makes that pain feel a lot less. Right now my tolerance is high enough that I get the pain without the relief. But that's a good thing because I like that pain. As weird as that sounds, I kind of live for that. Just never got weird enough, you know that? All right, how you feeling, dude? Hot. Ah. Like, yeah. A bounce back right here. Yeah. Three and a half minutes. Let's go. What was that? Huh? <laughs> Three and a half minutes. Three and a half minutes. At any point during this contest, was your heat out of heaven? Oh, it is blue past seven. Blue past seven. It is blue past seven. Yeah. <laughs> 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 So here's the thing, though. He is, he's got he, he's in pain. There's no two ways about it. Not that I want to speak for the guy, but he's in pain. But I'm telling you, he's having a good time. <laughs> Aren't you? Yeah, for sure. And it, it, you know, to, to think of eating like you know a whole two of the hottest peanuts in the world all at once and finding that a pleasurable experience. Some of the people are going to scratch their head at that and just go, "What is wrong with you?" But a lot of you nuts, you get it. Right. Right. Yeah. Huh? Part of the Scoville squad, they understand. Like, am I addicted to the endorphin rush? No, man, I can quit anytime. But it is fun. Yeah, I'm addicted. I am what I am. I don't hide anything. I don't lie to you guys. God bless you, Al. That happens, man, making those nuts. You're gonna get that. Are yours burning still? Yeah. Really? Now you can get any ear burn, nothing. These are hot. <laughs> These are hot. Now, come here, I asked a question. Recently, you did the Death Nut Challenge. I watched that, it was great. Um, how do you uh, factor, like, if, what would you rate, uh, if you said, on a scale of one to 10, how bad hard would you rate this challenge? Compared, compared to the Death Nut Challenge? Yeah. Um, well. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, the way I did it, the Death Nut Challenge is a lot harder. Right. Yeah, just because I had two on top of the white blue one. My pain was excruciating. This? There's no words for it. It's just like you gotta experience for yourself. It's like, a different kind of heat. Yeah. It really is. The cap state, listen, when you have the, the <gasps> yeah, I don't care how hot the powder is. Hot powder burn is a hot powder burn, but when you introduce uh, pure capsaicin crystals at 13 million, it's a different animal. Yeah. It really is. That's an altogether different animal. It burns you differently, it attacks you differently, it burns harder. It lasts longer and oh yeah, and that's what it is. It just like lasts like the key, It's got legs, man. It yeah. keeps going and going. And the other thing is this: if you've never had capsaicin crystals, this is a what is going on kind of a burn. You, it'll be something you haven't experienced before. Right, right. right. So that, that's when panic mode sets in. You haven't, you don't hit panic mode today because you've been burned so hard in the past. Yeah. You know you're not going to die. You know this is. But had you experienced that on day one of the oh, David and Goliath, it probably wouldn't have been a second. Right, exactly. Yeah, like this is like completely different. It's the same. Like it, you have to try. It's you surreal. Have to, have to try. Yeah. It's crazy. It's funny. That's why David and I have these festivals, man. I told you, one of these days, we're gonna, we have another 37 seconds. One of these days, I'm going to make a video of just stories from festivals of people that came up. Bless you. Bless you. People like. <laughs> People that came up and, and tried a peanut oh. and just blew them away, blew their doors off. There's a lot of really funny stories. Yeah. Pure capsaicin. Pure capsaicin crystals right there. 
Wow. Right? That's Careful with that stuff. I'm serious, man. You gotta almost weigh that to the microgram. This stuff is crazy, crazy hot. All right, we're down to 10 seconds, and we've got a man in the League of Fire. I want everybody to give David a round of applause in the comment section. Let's go! Yes. Hey, man. Now, in the comment section, throw your kudos, man, to David. He's now ranked in the world. You know what? I remember the first time I got in the League of Fire. I remember thinking to myself, I've done a lot of things in my life. I've never been ranked in the world about anything. To be the world's biggest idiot is an accomplishment. I mean, to be, to be the yeah, sure. top of the world in anything is an accomplishment. And you are now ranked in the world. And now what you can do is there are different tables. Yeah. You just order, I think you just earned seven points. Nice. All right? Here's yeah. the crazy thing. Every time you eat one, you earn seven points. Really? It's not like you do it once. Every time, in fact, I just earned seven points. <laughs> um, so, you know, so, and there are other things. There are chocolate bars, there are, there's so many chug challenges, or, and I have, you know what? I've got two bottles of the V2 chug challenge left. That may be an easier way for him to get into the League of Fire than this. This is a brutal challenge. Yeah, uh, yeah, for sure. But, uh, yeah, so uh, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna uh, do a series on a channel, Journey to the Top 10. Ah, there you go. Yeah. Aspirations of top 10. Yeah. I love it. Good. Yeah, and here's the thing, you know, it's, it's, it's about, con here's a, try to imagine this. If somebody's like a marathon runner, every day, if you're in marathon shape, it is said that every day you don't run, you lose 3% of your condition. Yeah. Eating spicy stuff at the level that we're at, if we take a few days off, if I take two days off from heat, which I have never done in the last five years, I have not taken a day off, I just can't. But if I took two days off, it would be a noticeable difference the next time I ate something hot. Right. It would be. Now, I'm not doing it to keep my, my tolerance high. I do it because I'm addicted to this stuff. You know, it's healthy, it's good, it's legal. But man, I, that's one of the first, you know, one of the first things I think of. Not the first thing, but one of the first things I think of when I wake up is what pepper I'm going to eat this morning. You look lit. Yeah, yeah. You have uh, a thousand yard stare in your eye a second ago. That's pretty cool. Right. Fun challenge, though, isn't it? Yeah, definitely fun. Definitely. Uh, now, now, let's get this. Your thoughts after the fact, because I know we were talking two nights ago, you're like, yeah, maybe we'll do two. Feature video, we'll definitely do two. Definitely. I was <laughs> Mr. Boy's <laughs> first. So, um, it was, was it harder than you thought? Was it um, kind of what you expected? A lot harder than I expected, a lot harder. Um, just, but the mentality of just, Facing it. Someone's got to do it. Why not you? Like, you just got to <laughs> do it. Someone's got to do it. So, like, yeah. So, honestly, it's really fun. Uh, I don't know, it's, it's crazy. It's awesome. It. Well, that's one of the things about JC is that we tend to run at things that most people run away from, including right. problems and things like this. Right. And you ran at this one today. Right. I'm proud of you, Dave. <laughs> well done, dude. Thank you. All right, guys, so hop over to The Pepper Apprentice and give him a like and a follow. Um, that was David tackling and completing and being victorious. Right? <laughs> yeah. And now you got to sign this and maybe, uh, well, I, is that the one I signed? There's the one I signed. I signed this. What you ought to do is sign it and do it as a giveaway for one of your fans. Be a cool thing. Yeah. Uh, guys, you're awesome. Thank you for hanging out with us. Um, right here is our pepper. If you've never clicked that thing, click our pepper. If you, uh, you become part of the family. If you don't want to miss a video, there's a little bell. You click that bell, a Dropbox will appear. Hit all and you will miss nothing, like the live stream we did yesterday. Right in front of David is League of Fire, which he is now in. Ranked in the world. Become a part of that. You too can be in the League of Fire. It doesn't take much just to eat a tube of these. How bad can it be, right? Right? How bad? <laughs> <laughs> and right there, a bunch of videos for you guys to watch. Thanks for hanging out. I'm Johnny Scoville. I'm David Martin. And this was Chase the Heat.